I know, I saw it. Oh, that was quite a move you just made. It smells like vanilla in here, baby. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know you were a video on there. <laughs> <laughs> it does smell like vanilla in here. Oh my heck. Did you do it, did you? It was a tough spot. Good, Good morning, morning, everyone. It is <laughs> Monday morning. It's bedtime. It's family day. And yes, I am wearing a shirt. Don't worry. <laughs> it didn't look like I was, but I am. Um, Curtis worked last night in Rogersville. Yep. In Ford's Mills. In Elsie. Elsie, which is uh, the reservation. And we were up Daddy. in Miramichi for a little bit. In Miramichi, he ran all night long. You didn't even have a call, did you? We had two calls. Oh, you did. Okay. Yeah, I did. had two calls, day. apparently. I wasn't listening, I guess. One was a canceled call. So okay. We only canceled one. Anyways, he got two hours of sleep. I'm dead. Squished together. Like, if you take all the little naps, yeah, that's not enough. So, his family day is going to look like sleep <laughs> and our family day is gonna look like cool. staying home yeah it's gonna look like what what was that winnie cool it's gonna look like cool i'm hanging out with you guys i'm only having a nap because i gotta sleep tonight at home so i might as well be tired for sleep tonight okay well curtis is gonna sleep away the morning and um today later today probably not this morning maybe like lunchtime we'll see but i'm gonna try out the new um frozen fruit sorbet ice creamy type maker thing i'm so excited i put some bananas in the freezer last night so that they would be like frozen <laughs> like i'm waking up to a snack yeah you might we'll Ooh, see maybe. i'm excited we gotta try lots of different ways i'm not gonna get frustrated gotta try lots of different ways that's what she said oh my head i know sometimes when you try something new it doesn't always work out the best so i'm going to try lots of different ways to get it going um it is minus 10 outside right now so kind of warm <laughs> Compared to what it's been, it's it should be okay. I think I'm gonna go for a walk this morning. Um, Winnie's gonna stay here with the boys because I don't really want to walk with her. And <laughs> she wouldn't want to go with me anyways. So I'm gonna take Jasper for a walk first thing, and then I'm gonna come back to some coffee. Oh, I wanna come. Um, <laughs> you need to sleep. I can sleep later. No, freaking crap. I hate sleeping days. <laughs> he really hates when he has to sleep after he gets home from work because he's already gone from us when he's at work and then when he ha comes home and then he has to sleep, he's gone for uh, gone from us longer. That's the way he sees it. Anyways, um I'm not sleeping. He's going to sleep. I got, I'm going to stop talking about what we're going to do because it's just going to make him jealous. But actually, I don't really think we're going to do a lot today, but it's going to be fun no matter what. Um if you missed the last couple vlogs you're gonna have to go back and watch them because we had some little valentine's day treats for you in both videos and lots to make you laugh and even some to make you oh <laughs> anyways i'm gonna get dressed i'm wearing my pajama shirt it means no worries <laughs> all right i'm <laughs> i'm tired but i'm gonna get up anyways i started watching um the sinner last night on netflix do not recommend it is bad i already watched the first season a couple years ago um but i'm watching the second season i think right now but the little boy that kind of killed his parents so you know it was, it was a little creepy and uh that's what i fell asleep watching so miranda had a few weird dreams but <laughs> i'm gonna go for a walk and listen to some sermons <laughs> I feel like I could use a couple sermons right now. Anyways, it's family day. It's family day. And we don't have to work. And we don't have school. And guess what? We're supposed to get a snowstorm tomorrow. So Cooper might have all of his dreams come true. And he might have a snow day tomorrow. So it might be a three-day school week. I'd be totally okay with that. And Curtis does work tomorrow. But um, he only works in our small town. So he has like a five-minute drive to work. So, um even if the roads are crappy, he'll be fine. Anyways, I'm going to get dressed because I'm not wearing this outfit on my walk. 
and uh, minus 10. It's going to be warm, right? It's going to be warm. Yeah, it's going to be a fun walk. Come with me. I'm ready to head out the door, <laughs> but I want to show you my socks this morning. <laughs> Check these babies out, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Who is she? I don't know, but she cute. <laughs> I just want to share the beauty with you guys. <sighs> the sun is shining. There's snow everywhere. We got another snowstorm coming tomorrow. <sighs> but it's beautiful. You ready, buddy? Let's keep walking. Come on. <laughs> it's a little cold, but it's not super cold every time the wind blows i'm like <laughs> r.i.p to my cheeks <clears throat> i've been using so much face cream you guys and cream for my hands too um the stuff that i got from sephora is working really good if you wondered um i'll show you later when i get home because i'm gonna have to put some more on you hear that airplane we have single occupant or like double occupant airplanes that fly over us all the time. We're really close to a flight school here. And it's crazy because like you'll hear that noise. You hear it? And then all of a sudden it'll cut. There won't be a noise at all. And they're drifting. <laughs> and I'm like, turn it back on. Turn the engine back on. Stop drifting. <laughs> Anyways, it's kind of funny. But also, I'm a fearful kind of girl, you know. <laughs> Anyways, we're going to walk down and around the village a little bit. See what's going on on family day. I actually do need to go to the grocery store today because we don't have any butter. And more butter, more better, right? And I don't have any. <laughs> so I do want to make some baked potatoes, but I can't do that unless we have butter. You can't have baked potato without butter. Anyways, my thoughts are traveling. I'm going to go back to listening to Pastor Stephen Furnick. He's talking about um, something about pain. Uh, potential of pain. That's what I'm learning about today. And it's about Peter. And he said Peter was the kid in class who um, always raised his hand, asked questions, and always questioned the teacher. <laughs> Speaking of Jesus, you know. If you know Peter, then you know that's who he was. And as he was saying that, I was like, did I marry Peter? I think I did. <laughs> that's exactly who Curtis was in school and still is now. Constantly questioning authority. <sighs> I love that guy. Anyways, I married a Peter. Who did you marry? A John? <laughs> Maybe an Andrew? Oh, maybe a Doubting Thomas. <laughs> Anyways, if you're not a Bible kid, then you don't know what the heck I'm talking about. But Jesus loves you. Don't forget it. <laughs> Holy. Ice all over these sidewalks, guys. <laughs> I almost looped her. Oh, my heck. <sighs> This is Main Street, guys. Pretty exciting. There's a dog walking in front of us, so guess who's pulling me? <laughs> oh my goodness. This is my small town. Pretty cute, huh? Do you guys have snow? We got a bit. <laughs> we usually have more than this, actually. But we're about to get that snowstorm tomorrow, so add to the pile. I am so excited for spring and warmer weather. I literally want to walk so much more, but it's so hard to push yourself to do it when you know how cold it is out and how much time it's going to take you to feel normal again <laughs> when you get home. Look at this treasure, guys. Jasper can't even see above the snow piles. He's like, mom, <laughs> come on, Jess, let's go. Let's go. It's like a tunnel. Oh my heck, you guys, the ice. Well, if you don't hear from me again, you know, I fell and cracked my head open. <laughs> Thinking positive though. Thinking positive thoughts only. 
and contributing to my obesity, we have <laughs> KV Takeout. Friggin' delish. <laughs> and if you're not into a greasy spoon, see that place right there? P mill, pizza mill, pizza Friday mill, pizza any day mill, except for Sundays and Mondays because small towns, they're closed. <laughs> <laughs> That's contributed probably a solid 30 pounds, <sighs> give or take, you know. <sighs> that dog's still in front of us, guys. My arm's gonna fall off. <laughs> Look at these two dogs. Can you see them? They're huge. And they bark like crazy every time. Hi! Oh my goodness, hi! Hi friends! You say hi friends! <laughs> hi guys! Happy family day! <laughs> I'm gonna take you down to the house I was raised at. We lived at 20 McDonald Road growing up um, and all of these like duplexes and houses and stuff, those came through the years that I was living here. Um, we actually saw, I remember one day we were kids, we saw a house, I'll show you what house, come down on a truck. <laughs> like an actual house was pulled down on a truck and we took pictures of it. And as kids, we thought that was like, what? A house on wheels? <laughs> and it's a big house too. Anyways, my parents moved from that house, from this house that I'm about to show you. Um, they moved from that and bought a farmhouse up close to our Irving Big Stop. Come on, Jess. And um, yeah, they lived up by the Irving Big Stop for a few years then they sold that to this trucking company that wanted the land um oh my land jasper's pulling me so hard <laughs> he's used to not running on a leash he's used to being well i guess he should be used to being on a leash he prefers to run loose but you can't do that in the village so jess <sighs> um Anyways, and now they live somewhere else. They still live in the same village, but um, yeah. It's weird when your parents move out of the house that you grew up at, which worries me because I know I don't want to live at the house that we're at and retire there. It's kind of just the house to raise the kids. I don't want that big of a house. It's too big. I want to have a much smaller house to retire in. One floor, basically, no staircases. Um, that's what I would prefer, <sighs> but it is a weird feeling when your parents move out of your childhood home because it's like, it's not your home anymore. When you go to their house, it's weird. It, like your, your parents are there. Sure. But it's not your home. You know, it's a weird feeling, but, uh, anyways, it was nice to live right in the village as a kid. We lived really close to the um, pool, the community pool. We bike up to the pool all the time and we live really close to the school. My mom was a teacher. We all walked to school. Anyways, there's somebody walking this way. So just, just hold on a second. <laughs> this big house guys right here was the house that got pulled down on a truck, <laughs> came right down the street. I think they added on that entryway after, but it was like that big farmhouse. Crazy, eh? And this right here was the house I grew up in. 20 McDonald. Lots of memories in that house. I wonder what it looks like inside. I've wondered that for a while. Anyways, that's the one. And there's the driveway that I played hoops on all the time. We had a basketball net actually on the shed and there used to be, it doesn't look like there is anymore, but there used to be a pathway from my backyard to the school, which is through there. Anyways, kind of fun. 
now I gotta walk back home. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you liked the tour. <laughs> I'm gonna walk back home now. The only reason I even came this way uh, is because the lady with the dog that was walking in front of us, um, she took my road. <laughs> And I was sick of walking behind her. So I was like, fine, I guess I'll go a little longer. <sighs> Anyways, my hands are frozen. Like, completely frozen. I even have mittens on. But uh, I can't have it on when I'm holding the camera. So I'm going to safely put my camera back in my pocket. Turn my sermon back on. And get to walking. Hopefully Curtis is sleeping. He texted me a couple times, but... Maybe I should read those, <laughs> but hopefully he's sleeping. I'll see you when we get back home. <sighs> back home. It's 10.38, time for coffee, and maybe a bowl of cereal with some blueberries and raspberries, and then brought some laundry up from downstairs. I have so much laundry to do, because I didn't do it. I haven't done it since. Thursday, Thursday or Friday? I think Thursday though, maybe Friday. I don't know, it's been a while and it's Monday. So lots of stuff to be done. And you need to have a bath because we haven't washed your hair since you put hair chalk in. Living the life, huh? Living the life. <laughs> you wanna have some more breakfast too? Yeah. Yeah, okay. <laughs> She's adorable, huh? <laughs> I'm having this really messy sloppy joe for lunch and a dill pickle salad. She added some cucumbers too. It's gonna be good. Soup. Let me see. What do you guys have? And look who woke up from his nap. I'm only half awake. <laughs> no, I have a wag. <laughs> Eat something, you'll feel better. I will. You look great. <laughs> I just had my shower and now I'm going to open this baby up, learn how to use it, clean it, and then use it. <laughs> there are only three parts to it, so it shouldn't be that hard to figure out. <laughs> Fingers crossed. I'm going to open this little information pamphlet instructions and figure it out. I'm surprising myself. I built it. This comes out, you put the food in, you squish it down. Winner, winner, frozen dessert dinner. <laughs> um, it even comes with this little recipe book, which is like really cute. There's one in here that's like peach cobbler. I don't have any frozen peaches right now. They'll look at that, oh my heck. <laughs> I love peaches. Peach cobbler frozen fruit. Yes. So all I have to do is clean this little thing. This is like a little thing that goes on top of this thing. And then I don't know how to get this one back out. Oh yeah, spin. Yeah, okay. A little, hey! <laughs> so I just have to wash that and then we're good to go. <sighs> okay. I'm excited and Winnie really wants to help. So now that I got it figured out, she can help me. The queen has arrived. We got some frozen strawberries and frozen bananas and we are gonna get to work. You wanna hear how loud it is? Three, two, no. one. It's a little loud. <laughs> ah! <laughs> it was moving. <laughs> All right, we got the little bowl here. We got the pusher thinger. All right. To do that, and we're gonna do Mommy's a banana gonna first. Mommy's gonna put the bananas in, and I'm gonna put the strawberries in. All right. Okay, let's get it going. Oh, geez. <laughs> <laughs> ah! <laughs> let's see. Are you gonna do it? Me? There we go. I think the banana's really frozen. <laughs> Look, it's working. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is fun. <laughs> Look, you guys. It totally worked. 
I'm gonna try it. Yeah, are you ready to try it? Okay. Okay. I'm gonna try the strawberry. Okay, I wanna try like a mix. This is probably. You gonna try strawberry? Strawberry. That's pretty good. Strawberry. It tastes like a smoothie. Strawberry. Only like thicker. Which is pretty much exactly what it is. What is that? Strawberry. Mm-hmm. Try it. Want to try it, Dad? Try it. Mm hmm You should try. So are we going for the this, banana this, or the strawberry? This, this, or do you go this, for a mix? This is banana and strawberry. Maybe I'll go for a middle. mix. A little banana, a little strawberry. That is good. And pick the strawberry. This time. Pretty decent, eh? It's basically a smoothie. Mm-hmm. So... Why do we use this rig instead of a blender? Because if you have a blender, it won't move unless you put a bunch of almond milk in it. Oh, and then it turns it to stuck. liquid instead of like an ice cream yeah. thickness. Yeah. That's pretty mm. cool. Oh, I'll go. You like it, Winnie? Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Good job, <laughs> That's pretty good. Cool. It's good, you guys. Totally. It yeah. definitely tastes healthy. So don't think you're eating a frosty. Because it's not a frosty. Just put some frosty telling, chocolate in. I'm telling myself this. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez, you scared Whoa. me. I gotta go in the tent now. We set up a tent. Oh my heck. Are you for real? Yeah. It's really big. I didn't even know what he was Come doing. On, guys. <laughs> it's a real full <laughs> tent. <laughs> <laughs> oh my heck. <laughs> what? What are you guys going to do in here? It smells like camping out here. What are you doing? She wanted to do something fun. so And she was also annoyed by me working, so she wanted to do something fun while I finished my job. Oh. So here I am. You lucky game. Here's your camping chair. And I'll make up your camping bed. We should get your sleeping bag, too. That's what you get when you marry a big kid. And in this case, we kind of both act like big kids just in different ways. Let me tell you something about this. The banana, the consistency of that, it's so creamy. Like, like really creamy. I don't even know how to explain it. You know what would be good? <laughs> Just like brainstorming, brainstorming. You know what would be really good? I did get some Greek yogurt. Maybe I should try that for next time. That's what I'll do. But you know what I should do? Do you like it? Yeah, I really do. Do you want to mix them together, all of them? <laughs> well, let's save the rest for tomorrow. I want Cooper to try it. You want to holler at Cooper? <laughs> what I was gonna say is it would taste really good if you took like actual frozen yogurt and then straight up mixed smushed up fruit in the frozen yogurt then you're getting like a treat because it's frozen yogurt I should have just waited <laughs> um, yeah because then you're getting a treat frozen yogurt but then you're getting fruit smushed up fruit you know you want to come try this coop <laughs> the more like yellowy kind is mostly frozen banana. The super red kind is just frozen strawberries. And like the mixed color is frozen strawberries and banana mixed together. But it worked really good in the machine. I think you'd like to do it. Why are you doing it in slow motion? <laughs> It just tastes like a smoothie without the... Really? Why are we getting a face? Too you much, love smoothies. Too much strawberry taste. <laughs> How old are you? That's, that strawberry tastes too much like strawberry. Mom! I hate it when my strawberries taste too much like strawberries. <laughs> I did buy this Greek yogurt. I wasn't thinking. If I had been thinking, 
I would have just bought frozen yogurt instead of Greek yogurt. But I'm gonna try it anyways. I've never had this kind of Greek yogurt before. It's really hard to open with one hand and now I'm stuck. <laughs> I'll be right back, I need this hand. <laughs> this looks really pretty. Let's give it a little shutty shot here. Oh my heck. Holy shnikes! That is so good. That's good. I mixed some yogurt in it. You want to try it? No. No. You scared of yogurt? Yeah. Look, look how pretty. Oh my goodness. Look how pretty you are. You know what that tastes like? Mmm. Have you ever had a yogurt parfait from Tim Hortons? That's exactly what that tastes like. Wow, I am in love. C'est l'amour. <laughs> this is so good. Thank you, Katie, for giving me this beautiful, yummy treat situation. Mm. Damn. Wow, <laughs> I couldn't even talk. This is the Greek yogurt. This is good. Go ahead, President's Choice. Vanilla. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay, so once a week, I'm going to bring you guys a new recipe with this because uh, it's for scientific and YouTube purposes, not because I just want to eat a whole bunch of treats, but I think it's all about balance, right? Mmm. That is seriously so good. Mm, mm, mm. This thing worked pretty good. Uh, excuse my hand placement. That was a little too much. <laughs> uh, it worked great. I think it was really hard for it to get through the banana. It did say in the recipe book, which by the way, that wasn't a recipe. That was just a... Um, but I did read in the recipe book that it said to let the bananas, let the frozen banana sit out for a few minutes beforehand, which I did do, but maybe not enough. It said five minutes, but maybe my bananas were extra frozen. I don't know. Cause it did struggle a little bit to get through that, but wow. Like actually I'm, I'm super impressed. If you guys have one of these things, let me know. Let me know what your favorite uh, combination is. Adding that yogurt, you guys. Wow. Mm-hmm. Mm. I got it popping, baby. Yes? He doesn't like yogurt. You add that. yogurt to this, I'm no longer interested. Mm -hmm. But he would probably like the frozen yogurt. Anyways, I'm going to clean up this mess. I'm going to eat some more of this little treat. And then I'm going to disassemble my new... Sorry, hand placement. My new best friend. <laughs> I'm trying not to be awkward and inappropriate. It just happens. <laughs> Get in there. All right, we are adding some more yogurt to it. Winnie wants to mix it, mix it, mix it. So I thought, let's put some more frozen yogurt, or yogurt in it. Then we'll take the rest and freeze it and see if we can't make frozen yogurt all by ourselves. Good. Think that's enough? Maybe a couple more scoops. Mom! Mom! That's a lot. It's going to be good. You think it is. I hope so. All right, give it a real big mix now. Ooh. Okay, mix it up. Mix, mix it. It might be pink Ooh. because white and red. Mm -hmm. mix. Make strawberry banana yogurt. Frozen yogurt. Oh, do you think it's possible? It's possible. It looks pinky. That looks so pretty. Let's Doing a great job, Mixer. <laughs> and Cooper's been vacuuming to try and earn some more time. Because yeah. you haven't done anything today to earn time except for play electronics with Winnie for a little bit. And you've been on electronics since when? The nine. <laughs> since you woke up? Mm -hmm. That looks good, Winnie. Looks really pinky. Ooh, can I try a bite of it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, that you. looks good. <laughs> Much is good. Okay, when you wanted to feed me. <laughs>
good. T6 movie, you'll get something. That's pretty good. Mmm. Mm hmm. Maybe one more scoop. It's like Yay. thick. That's good. <laughs> what are you laughing about? Ooh, you're making coffee for tomorrow morning. Yep. Hey, Coop, what kind of day are you hoping for tomorrow? Snow day. A what? Snow day. Snow day! I think you're gonna get it. I don't know. <laughs> Am I? So, Winnie was such a good helper, and she dumped all of the soon to be frozen yogurt into here to a classic Tupperware container. And. I don't know. Maybe I'll show you later. Might have to wait till tomorrow, though. I don't know how long it's going to take to freeze. Curtis told me they were going to go outside in their t-shirts. And she's got Crocs on, you guys. This is just, it's unacceptable. It did warm up a little bit from my walk this morning. But not. What are you doing? No. <laughs> oh, her feet are going to be so cold. This is not a good idea. Oh my heck, you guys. Oh, controlling nature wants to freak out right now. Oh my heck. If his mom sees this. You think your mom wants you to do that? <laughs> I said, do you think your mom would want you doing that? My mom doesn't make my choices anymore. Mm, pretty sure she'd be pretty ticked off. Well, she could just go pound sand. Oh. <laughs> That's right, Mom. Um, Curtis, she was walking in the snow with no socks on in her Crocs. I think it's an awesome idea. 30 seconds and your asses are back in. Eh, five minutes. No! Five minutes. Then no supper for you! I don't want any. <laughs> I, it's cold. I opened that window. And it's cold. So I'm going to literally watch the clock. It is 3.53. And they're getting about one and a half to two minutes. And even that I'm not happy about. But she's laughing. But it's... I. This is t terrible parenting. Terrible parenting. Then get your butt in here. <laughs> Okay, good. Oh, this is ridiculous. I mean, I know we're Canadian, but this is taking it too far. She's six. <laughs> She's having fun though, I know. Oh, you poor thing. Jeez Louise. I'm gonna grab a really fuzzy pair of socks for those poor feet. Oh, these ones are really thick. Are you frozen? Are you totally frozen? <laughs> Your poor feet. Mommy got you some big socks to put on, okay? Why are you so worried about it? Uh, because I'm her home. mother. And I'm her father. <laughs> exactly. Okay. I'm okay. You're okay? Of course she's okay. She's getting warmed up, but were you warm or were you cold? cold. Very cold. Right. How about the real question? Snow and the fire? Was it fun? Yeah. Sometimes yeah, being so. fun isn't all that matters. Listen. You dingus. We're going back in the tent. Oh, if you weren't up. so hot, I would really actually still kind of want to do something. Right. <laughs> I'm gonna go okay, okay, yes, go get warmed up. Coming in. Look, look at the lights they put in here, guys. You turn off the what does Jassy think about this? What do you think? Huh? What do you think about this? Oh, my sakes. I wish we weren't having, um, for sure, no school tomorrow because then we could. So oh, jeez, Jasper! Don't say it. <laughs> <I push me. laughs> then we could sleep in. Don't here. say uh, what you're saying. What? Don't talk about a sleepover because I want to do stuff with you. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, married life. <laughs> I'm treating for lunch this week. Mm -hmm. We're eating out somewhere. The big fifty dollars. <laughs> Couple more zeros, and I would have been more than treating for a meal. Boom, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Happy Valentine's Day, baby. <laughs> fifty bucks. <laughs> 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 Woo! Yeah. <laughs> Just 
Just imagine what I would do if I won like five grand. <laughs> Things get real interesting up in here. Pray for the blessings, y'all. I want to see. Things are gonna get greater. <laughs> the big money winner right here, and I are gonna celebrate by eating supper the same way we ate lunch in front of the TV. Winnie already ate, so she's over there having a fudgical for dessert, and then she's gonna have a bath. Um, and the boys are just sitting down to eat, and they wanted to watch their phones, and I'm like, well, good, watch your phone, because I don't really want to sit with you at the table. Um, I don't think we should change our lifestyle with this win, though. Yeah, I know. We shouldn't let the money go to our heads, guys, right? Um, I and made... if you forget how much it was, just look back on the picture of what's on my belly. <laughs> Did you wash it off, or is it still there? Hey, <laughs> nice. Um, I didn't have time to make baked potatoes because when I started cooking supper, it was already five o'clock and now it's six something. And I knew if I was doing baked potatoes, it just would have taken so much longer. So I'm having mashed potatoes. They take way less time to cook. <sighs> Carrots and a little quesadilla, a quesadilla that I made extra bacon <sighs> and I could have had this a couple hours ago <sighs> I'm tired really tired but this is gonna be a nice meal I absolutely love sitting in this chair because of my scoliosis my back moves to this side like the top of my back so when I can sit somewhere that has like a little cushiony spot so I can lean up against it that is how I love to sit most of all. So I never take up the full chair. <laughs> I'm only sitting on this side. Hi. Was it good? Yeah. It was so good. And you're gonna have a bath as soon as mommy's done eating, okay? Yeah, but I still work showers. Yeah, do you wanna have a shower instead? Mm, no, because I want a bath bomb. Okay. Bath bomb, bath bomb. Bath bomb. Cheers, you guys. Cheers. Cheers, you guys. Cheers. Cheers, cheers, cheers. The dishes are done. The daughter is bathed. <laughs> and it's time for show and snack and time to go to bed. SpongeBob. Yeah, you can hear SpongeBob on. And I can see Jasper's tail Where? right behind your head. <laughs> We love you guys so much. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.